Hi guys, welcome to Empower and thank you so much as usual for watching my YouTube channel. So in this video, I wanted to talk about falling in love with nursing. Now let me tell you a little bit about my journey, the good things and the bad things. So obviously I decided to become a nurse because I really love working with people. I love the stimulating environment. Actually before I started nursing and when I was doing my prerequisites for college, I was a waitress and I just loved being able to serve people and communicate and have dialogue and get to know different people and be in a you know fast work pace environment. So my viewpoint nursing would be pretty similar the only thing that I wasn't really prepared to encounter was how much negativity can come with working with healthcare. I guess I should have expected it. I mean, you know, people are really sick in the hospital. People don't want to be in the hospital. I should have kind of not gone into it so blindly, but I didn't. So when I did get to nursing and was confronted with a lot of nurses that hated their job, I was scared. I was like, wow, am I really going to hate this? And ultimately, I did for a little while. Like, I was scared to pieces. I didn't like nursing. I actually tried to switch my major, but my parents almost had a heart attack. So I was like, all right, I'll stay with nursing. <laughs> I'll at least finish. And it really wasn't until about eight months on the job that I finally said, wow, this is nice. I like it. And then once I allowed myself to like the things that I did like about the job, then I started to do more of those things. You know, I started to connect a little bit more with my patients, go the extra mile. One time I had a conversation with a patient and we had a lovely conversation. And then a few days later on Thanksgiving, I went in and took her some flowers, you know? So like putting your heart into everything is one way to love the job. Now, I really think that if you don't act actively do things to minimize the negative and increase the positive, there's a very real possibility that you'll get burnt out and burnt out very quickly. Now again, when I say burnt out, burnt out to me is not like a permanent thing. I get burnt out from time to time quite a bit. So I don't see a lot of permanence in that. I just see that as me needing some me time. <laughs> But I think that, you know, we really have to take into perspective a lot of the negativity that comes to us and not focus on it and focus only on the good things. And it's easy to say not to focus on something, but actually it's impossible for our minds to do that. So one thing that you can do, and this is what I do, is that when I am focusing on something that is negative about my job, then I quickly replace that with the polar opposite, which is extremely positive. And so let's say like my director was like really mean to me. She called me into the office and was like having this conversation like I'm a two year old. Then what I usually do is I switch it. I have us standing up together. She's smiling. She's telling the CEO of the hospital how amazing I am. You know, so I just switch it in my mind so it emotionally releases the anger that was you know held so these like simple mind tricks like they sound they sound silly but actually they really work they work because they work on the emotional level and we actually more than anything it's our emotions that control us more than anything else so anyways I hope that this encourages you to find ways that you can love your job it is possible it really is possible I've seen nurses work 20 30 40 years and really love their job so it is possible to love it alright guys I really hope that you like this tip for motivation Monday I cannot wait to see you again very soon and have a wonderful week bye let's stay connected guys no matter where you are in the world join me here every Monday at 6 30 a.m. Eastern time for the weekly nursing free huddle before for your regular huddle. This will help you start your week off on the right note. Also, get email notifications as soon as the videos are published. By joining my email list, you will receive 25% discount on my best-selling books. The first book, How to Succeed in Nursing School, has been called the best nursing school preparation guide for thousands of students just like you. Many say it's a must-read before entering nursing school. In this book, I share how I went from a very average student to graduating nursing school with honors. It also includes tips on how to choose your nursing school, how to be successful in nursing school, and how to stay motivated and driven while in nursing school. The second book, New Nurse, How to Get, Keep, and Love Your Nursing Job is an outstanding book to help nurses start their careers on the right foot or rekindle their love for nursing. We all join this profession for altruistic reasons, but some
sometimes the stress of the job has us beaten down. This book, I promise, will help you reignite your love for the amazing work you do. And finally, by joining, you will also have access to a 40% discount for my How to Study for Anatomy and Physiology program. In this program, I share how I went from a C average student to two semesters later was on the dean's list. I've shared these tips with thousands of other students and they have phenomenal results. Click here for information on how to join my email list. And oh yeah, make sure you subscribe to the channel also. I'll see you guys next week. Love you. Bye.